Undoubtedly, one of the all-time greats in football and, more specifically, the greatest goal scorer to ever step onto the field is Cristiano Ronaldo. He is one of the game's greatest goal scorer. The Portuguese forward has broken all sorts of records in an unbelievable career and scored some stunning strikes along the way. In a professional career spanning more than two decades, Ronaldo has played in Portugal, England, Spain, Italy, and Saudi Arabia, representing some of the biggest clubs in the world. Here are some of his most special strikes. Let's start with his bicycle kick wonder. In 2018 Champions League quarterfinal match between Real Madrid versus Juventus, Ronaldo scored a bicycle kick wonder arguably the finest goal Ronaldo has produced. Moving away from goal as Danny Carvajal dug across towards the penalty spot from the right, the Portuguese threw himself a full 2.38 meters off the ground, almost exactly crossbar height, and made perfect contact with his right boot, producing a marvelous overhead kick. His leg was at a right angle to his body as he struck with the sweetest of volleys that flew past an idle Gianluigi Buffon. The perfect finish also brought the perfect reaction, Juventus fans rising to their feet to applaud the individual genius, even though they knew the goal had virtually ended their team's chances of progress in the competition. Nine years before that marvelous goal against Juventus, his 40-yard screamer in Champions League quarterfinal match between Manchester United versus Porto was something to talk about. He had absolutely no right to score this one back in his homeland for a Champions League quarterfinal against Porto. But the former sporting player was clearly keen to stamp his name on the occasion. Just six minutes in, he received a pass from teammate Anderson deep in midfield. Ronaldo picked up the ball in the middle of the opposition half, got it out of his feet, and sent a searing strike flying past Helton to seal a 1-0 win at the Estadio do Dragao and a 3-2 aggregate triumph. It was the goal which decided the tie and was also the first winner of the Puskas Prize. Incredible strike indeed. A stunned Porto side never recovered, and Sir Alex Ferguson's men progressed toward a final where they would beat Chelsea to lift the trophy. The long-range strike was also voted United's goal of the decade by fans in 2010. Ronaldo couldn't stop at that. Later, he defies the law of gravitational force by scoring a gravity-defying header in 2019 against Sampdoria for Juventus. Ronaldo's athletic prowess was never more apparent than during a Serie A fixture against Sampdoria for Juventus. After an impressive lift measured at 8.39 feet, Ronaldo scored with a stunning header, leaving fans and opponents in awe. Ronaldo appeared to hang in the air as he lined up the header, something opposition manager Claudio Ranieri compared to the sort of vaulting athleticism usually seen on a basketball court rather than a football pitch. He reached a height of 2.56 meters when he made contact with the ball, according to the Juventus website, having jumped 71 centimeters off the ground. Despite approaching the end of his career, Ronaldo's sheer physical abilities were clear for all to see and served as a reminder that he really is in a world of his own. Manchester United vs Portsmouth, January 30, 2008 Possibly the best free kick of Ronaldo's career. The Portuguese, who became known for his superb handling of set pieces while playing for United, he lashed a phenomenal 25-yard effort past David James as part of a double to send Alex Ferguson's side to the top of the Premier League. Prior to moving to Real Madrid, one of Ronaldo's greatest seasons wearing a Manchester United uniform was 2007-2008, during which he scored a number of stunning goals. His knuckleball technique sent the ball swirling into the top right corner for one of his defining Old Trafford moments. This goal, which combined a perfect mix of precise aim and unwavering power, remains ingrained in fans' minds and is frequently hailed as one of the greatest free-kick goals in Premier League history. This list wouldn't be complete without mentioning Ronaldo's artistry during Real Madrid's demolition of Espanyol in 2016. Although his game had become more refined from those buccaneering early days, Ronaldo showed here he was not quite done when it came to solo runs and spectacular finishes. 
While the final action from Ronaldo was nothing to write home about, his Rabona cross to James Rodriguez, who promptly returned the ball to the Portuguese international to tap home, was a work of art and serves as the perfect example of his inventive creativity. He really was more than just a goal-scoring machine, with Madrid already 3-0 up in what would prove to be a 6-0 thrashing. He also bamboozled Thibaut Courtois in Real Madrid match against Atletico. In April 2012, Jose Mourinho's Madrid led La Liga, but were under pressure from chasing Barcelona. On a visit to neighbors Atletico Madrid, Ronaldo opened the scoring with a trademark swerving free kick, but Radamel Falcao equalized, and with 20 minutes left, Los Blancos' title challenge appeared to be faltering. That is, until Ronaldo picked the ball up out toward the left wing with plenty of defenders between him and the goal. Using Fabio Coentrao's overlapping run as a decoy, he took another touch to set himself and clipped a tremendously powerful shot that spun over Thibaut Courtois and down into the far top corner. He celebrated by rolling up his shorts to show everyone his thickly muscled right thigh and later completed his hat trick from the penalty spot as Madrid won 4-1. He didn't stop there. He even went on to rescue Portugal with a back heel. Portugal looked in serious danger of a shock exit from Euro 2016 as Hungary kept taking the lead in their final group game in Lyon. Ronaldo had not scored from 20 attempts in the first two matches, including a missed penalty in a 0-0 draw against Austria. But, as usual, when it really mattered, he stepped up with an assist and two equalizers in a 3-3 draw, which ensured progress to the knockout stages. His first of the game was the pick of the bunch, a neat backheel flick from Joao Mario's cross, which made him the first player to score in four different European Championship. Rewinding to his time at Real Madrid, back in 2012, Ronaldo showcased his remarkable speed and skill. His dazzling solo run goal against Osasuna in 2012 was a stunner. Collecting the ball left of center deep in Osasuna's half, the Portuguese took a couple of steps inside and unleashed a bullet with his right foot, which flew into the top corner from 35 yards out. He pointed to his leg muscles in the celebration. What a wonder strike. Ronaldo produced another jaw-dropping starts and finishes move at Anfield. Madrid came to Anfield in October 2014 as Champions League holders and quickly showed their authority by totally outclassing Brendan Rodgers' Liverpool side. It took Ronaldo just 23 minutes to showcase the gulf in quality. He dropped deep to take the ball from Luka Modric, played a 1-2 with Pepe, exchanged passes with Karim Benzema before running onto a return ball from James Rodriguez to finish with a devastating first-time flick of his boot past goalkeeper Simon Mignolet. Six different Liverpool players were taken completely out of the game as Ronaldo orchestrated the entire move, including scrambling skipper Steven Gerrard. They were all chasing shadows for the rest of the game as Carlo Ancelotti's team eased to a 3-0 win. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bells for more video on your favorite sport. Until the next one, please stay tuned.